a long journey ahead of us. No lolly lag no lolly lagging. Or whatever the guards here say. I don't abide fancy clothes, but you look like you might. I hear Radiant Raymond's has a large selection. Yes, yes. We've talked to them. Good day. The warm sand of elsewhere is far away from here. Okay. May your road lead you to warm sand. You too, sir. This character is not prepared for fighting. <laughs> but it's what you have to do. If getting into the Bard's College requires this, I, I guess he has to do it. Barren landscape. Gross. Oops. Ah, yes. I was wondering about those mountains. It looks like the map that I have installed somehow um, has put the map, map texture on, on the mountain background. I, I don't understand. Hmm. Belrand? Where did he go? Oh, he just couldn't keep up. He better keep up. He's the only thing keeping me alive. This is not a fighter. Ooh. Ooh. This doesn't concern you, citizen. Okay. Uh, Thalmor just disears. Falco is not a fan. This way to Dragon's Bridge. And there it is there. Well, it's been uneventful so far. Belrin, keep up. I, I do not like this guy. Something tells me he has some bad intentions. I'd better look forward while I'm walking. Dragon's Bridge. Let's just talk to some of the, lo the locals and see what's going Seems on. Some mean-spirited folk passed through lately. Uh oh. Thought I was rid of those sorts when I left Markarth. Welcome, traveler. Mind yourself and art. Hey, my family has connections in Markarth. Did you mention Markarth? I grew up an orphan on the streets of Markarth. I'd have died there too, but for the kindness of an old warrior named Logrolf the Bent. Huh. Logrolf rescued me and gave me enough money to get out of the city. I followed the Karth River north and came here. When I met Michelle, I knew this is where I belonged. I suppose that's it, Lou. Okay. And you mentioned some mean folk coming through. Both the Imperials and Stormcloaks have sent riders this way, scouting the bridge in the lands nearby. They stayed at the inn but didn't pay. They said soldiers don't need to pay because they're risking their lives to protect us. <coughs> and that's not all. They took a heap of our lumber and one tried to have his way with my daughter. They think they can do whatever they want. Yeah. That's pretty awful. Farewell. To see ya. Hey, what's the lowdown? Staying safe, I hope. Trying to. How am I doing? I am peckish, not thirsty, uh, slightly tired and sober. Maybe I should have a short rest in a, a tavern before I head out. I'm hoping to run my own inn someday. Oh, okay. Hey, you're the guy who's at the law, and you'll have no trouble in Dragonbridge. You were the guy at the Blue Palace, right? Mind you, don't cross Tassius. He's in charge around here. I don't know who that is. Weren't you worried about Wolf Skull Cave? I've done my part. Dragonbridge will have extra guards. Folk Firebeard will find a way to take care of the cave. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess it's taken care of then. Hello. Fate is the name. I keep the inn. Something different about you, I can tell. Hope you ain't here to cause trouble. Yeah, there, there is something different about me. I bet you'll never guess what it is. Uh, I'd like some water, please. 
and fill these uh, empty bottles. No, don't give me more. Thank you. Heard any rumors lately? Big talk of a little boy in Windhelm, name of Aventus Aretino. Get this, he's been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. <laughs> Foolish lad. Mm. What do you have for, for sale? The thirsty, food for the hungry. You. Butter is a light snack. It's, um... Ah. Milk drinker. Tomato soup. A couple of those. And maybe a herbal tea. And I'll take a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. All right. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Okay. Bellerin, do you... Let you me just stand there. Thanks. Thanks, Freda. Feda. Freda. It's either going to be night or very early morning when I wake up. Well, I guess it's day three now. Oh, there are a lot of people in here. If I should speak to some of them. Something on your mind? Mm. Who are you? Shady Sam. What's your name? Um, I'm not really, so I'm not going to talk to you. Um, anyone else? There was a third guy, but he might have left. Oh, hello. All right, then. You there. Eat my request. It'll only take a moment of your time. But what I ask, I ask plain. Okay. If you're a bard, for your own sake, do not sing. For your voice cannot compare to mine. Okay. All right then. I feel like Falco just honestly doesn't have a lot to say to these people quite There's often. A few more hours and I can crawl under some forest. None of that for us. We have an adventure. Let's see. I guess the easiest way to get to King Olaf's verse is to follow the road this way. So across Dragon's Bridge. Come on, Bellerand, Bellerand, keep up. You know, the way that I paid him really doesn't work in my favor. He already has the money. He could leave me at any point. And again, if I didn't pay him, he could kill me and then take the money. Either way, I'm very uncomfortable with this. Do not like it. I don't like how this has worked out. Oh! Sorry, I didn't see you there. Hello. What you want, stranger? I have a date with the marsh and the chorus that calls it home. Awesome. Um, just passing through. Then pass. Be like the wind. At least it has the courtesy not to speak. Okay. Oh no. What happened here? Hmm. That. Hmm. I 
beg my husband not to go, but he just wouldn't listen. He said if they delayed the show down, do 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 Ah. I might need that. I'm gonna take that book. Looks like these uh, folks were traveling on the road. I've been looking for Oh. You. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Okay. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Hold on. Stop. Hey. Hmm. Oh, did you need something? Yes. Can you report the um wait. I need you to report that these these people have been killed. Coward. Ah, uh, we'll do it, Bellerin. We'll, we'll just do it later. What are your thoughts on all of this? May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Ah, uh, you always know just what to say. Lead on, then. Okay. This way to King Olaf's verse. Oh, this is quite pretty. Even if it is, if it is a little bit of low resolution. Looks much better than the view from the docks, anyway. Ah, there's a camp over there. Probably shouldn't get involved. It's probably bandits. Everything. Leave me alone. What the hell? I don't have time for this foolishness. Now come along quietly and we won't have to get rough. Brother, I think she's telling the truth. I'm not going anywhere. Now back off before I do something drastic. She doesn't have the scarf. What? Oh, you're right. We've made a mistake. Now move along before that mouth of yours gets you into trouble. Next time you're looking to pester someone, make sure it's the right person. Foreigners. What a nuisance. What was that all about? They thought I was some other Red Guard woman. They just wouldn't leave me alone. I hope they get lost in the world. Yeah, how awful. Hey, what's going on? Yes? Who are you looking for? We're looking for information about a woman. A foreigner in these lands. She's a red guard, like us. It's we believe she may be hiding in White Run. But we're checking everywhere to be sure. That seems pretty vague. Mm -hmm. Until next time. Okay, so I'll yeah. keep I'll keep my eyes open for a random red guard woman. Who is a foreigner. My flowers. Is this, is this an, an encampment up here? What's going on here? Hmm. Very hungry. I better quickly eat something. And I'm no longer thirsty. Dog meat stew. I am full. It looks like Dead Man's Respite is just around the corner. But I'd have to go through this area. And this looks like a bandit camp. Well, they're clearly not hostile. Maybe if I just calmly walk through, everything will be fine. Nope! Nope. Bellerin, take care of it. Oh. Who did that? I have a sword and I may not know how to use it. But apparently I just killed a bandit anyway. I'll take that. I guess I'll upgrade. Our armor. Our boots. Our helmet. Our arrows. Take the mace as well. 
since it's recommended. Okay. Wow, I didn't even use this. <laughs> I didn't end up using the sword at all. Uh... Oh, shoot. Oops. sell this and I think I'll just hold on to it. Ow. Ow. I'll get I have a shield as well. Uh, that's an apparel actually. Got him. And I'll take that. So much easier to roll when you're dead. Uh. Victory. Uh. Skyrim belongs to the Take that battle I don't think I'm strong enough for that. Go, Bellerin, go. I'll stay up here where it's definitely safe. What the? Oh, oh! Hello. Oh! did it. That was amazing. This is, this is what you do all the time? Oh, this is easy. I'll take that. I already have all that. And I'm too weak for a Warhammer. Outlaws and brigands are the lowest of the low. They prey on their own country. Agreed. Black Arrow. Tree. Ooh. Up. Health. <clears throat> and I know this may be strange, but the first thing that I think I will level up for this character is haggling, because he is a merchant, and he would like to get better prices for things. And of course, anything that bandits have is a fair game. So there's no need to worry about this being stealing. If you're stealing from people who have taken all of the stuff that they own from other people, it, it, it's fine. Well, maybe not, but it won't be possible to track down the original owners anyway, and yeah, it's a fair game. Well, did I loot everyone down here? I did not. Uh, you take that. Hey, watch it. Ah, you ran into me. A lot of people have been doing that. Eriker's sister pushing me around like nobody's business. Uh, cave. This was a big camp. That is empty. Bandit leader's journal. Idiots. Brodeer and Herd were at each other's throats again today and nearly came to blows. The whole camp is on edge. I've ordered an extra ration of mead, but unless this fighting stops, we'll tear ourselves apart. Ah, da da da, mutiny. Ba da ba 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 da ba 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 da ba 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 da ba ba. Ah. So, basically, he's hidden something. Some treasure somewhere. I'm gonna take that bread and that cheese and that healing. And did I miss anything? Probably. Probably very likely. Take that coin purse. Ah. And the 
note said that somewhere on an island out here is where we would find the treasure. Over here? Ah, yeah. That is a treasure chest. And I had the key for it. Garnet. Arrows. I will take those boots. And I will take that staff. Apparel. Boots. We're gonna, eh, let's drop them. They're quite heavy. And where are my iron boots of minor stamina? Fantastic. Seems like there's an enemy over here. Is it a mud crab? Maybe a slaughter fish? I don't know what it is. Yeah, it's a slaughter fish. I wouldn't worry about it. Can't even see it. I don't know where it is. We're almost to Dead Man's Respite. Oh, this is easy. Easy money. Easier than being a merchant, that's for sure. Some sort of shanty here. Hello? Oh. Yes? Hey. Welcome to the Crabber Shanty, my lord. We got fresh crabs in the barrel and fresh crabs in our belly. Believe me when I say you don't want crabs anywhere. Sure. I'll, I'll have some mud crabs. How much? It's on the shanty, my friend. We've got a surplus of crab, and you'd be doing us a favor. So grab a bite, and grab an ale. But try not to grab my behind. <laughs> what the... Oh, I think there might be some mud crabs outside. Um... So what else do you do here, besides fish? You sound like a very interesting man. We just sit here and look at the sky for signs. Some hunters say you can see shapes in the clouds, or patterns in the stars. It's kind of like the old scryers who read the tea leaves. Sometimes they see the future. Most times they're just staring at a bunch of leaves. <laughs> Uh, what sort of signs are you looking for? Telling us if the heavy rains are coming. If the river rises, the crabs get washed downstream. That's a good day to be a crabber. Makes sense. Of course, a lot of strange things come down river. Sometimes even folks like you and me. Ooh. Bodies, I imagine. Sorry to say, that's often the case. Yeah. We try our best to bury them with the things. A grabber's got no use for weapons and jewelry. Of course, the dead got even less use for them. But we ain't here to fish pockets. Hmm. Well, thank you. Oh, right then. Oh. Hello. What? What am I going to do? What's the matter? My... my parents died. <sighs> and now I'm all alone. Ah. Well, I'm sorry. But you got Jisha, or whatever, Jish, whatever his name was. And you got this mud crab shanty. So you cheer up. And you got the bed. Okay, bye. Oh, it looks like he's gone. Well, you still have the hut. Come on, Bellerand. Let's leave this this poor orphaned Khajiit child. Let's take some mud crab, though. Oh, hello. Oh, there you two. You two are here. I don't want to use it. Okay. Okay, no more detours. We gotta get to this place. 
get King King Olaf first. Go back to the college. Uh, become a bard. Save some festival thing. Oh wow. This place is huge. And this place looks rather creepy. Where's Bellerin? The hell? How's this stuff for? Look at these stones. The ancestors knew how to build, no doubt. Yeah, what happened? Yeesh.